an example of seeking out someone to work with. I set up a studio tour for me and my classmates with Marcus Johnson, and he was impressed that I took the initiative to do that. I asked for his card. I said, is there anything you're working on? He said, yeah, I actually have a three album project that I have a deadline and I need to get done. If you send me any beats, I might buy some from you. And, and so I sent him three different instrumentals and he loved them and bought them and had me come in to record him. And we've been working together ever since. So that album that I worked on was number two on Billboard. So I was still at school with an album that was number two on Billboard's jazz charts. And so all the students were like, how'd you do that? I was like, it was that studio tour that we went to. And I just sent him some stuff and he liked it and kept working. So around then, like he, MJ actually showed me you know, you really got to get an LLC. He set me up on BMI and he was very generous. He split the songs 50-50 with me as far as the publishing. And usually when you're up and coming producer, you don't get that big of a percentage, but um, he was very generous. And, and one of the songs became the biggest hit from the triple album, the song Latin Funk. It's still going till this day. So my royalty checks were already starting back then. And I still get royalties from that song. It's played on a lot of different jazz radio stations. So that's the biggest song I've ever worked on, actually, as far as BMI royalties. So I thank him for giving me 50% of it. Like so many musicians aren't that generous, but he, he was very appreciative and very generous. So it worked out great. You learned to give back too. Yeah. Right, haven't you? Yeah, yeah my, my philosophy with publishing is just split it evenly with everyone involved. So if there are four people, we each get the same amount. And I learned that at a BMI songwriter panel and also from Marcus Johnson. But um, when you work with someone, you, you don't want to, even if you did more work, you don't want to say, well, I get a bigger percentage because I did more work. That just leads to disharmony down the line and, and people getting frustrated. But ever since I, I took on the, the concept of just split it evenly with whoever's involved everyone's been happy there have been no issues and uh it's been pretty smooth sailing so.